Super Bowl security is already falling into place for this weekend's big game, including equipment from our southern border and hundreds of officers and agents being brought to the valley for extra protection. I sat down with the Secretary of Homeland Security to talk about his department's efforts and what their concerns are heading into the weekend. What's your biggest fear for this weekend? My biggest fear for this weekend is that we go into overtime. Secretary of Homeland Security Jay Johnson is kidding, of course. I believe that we will have a safe and successful Super Bowl this Sunday. Secretary Johnson's belief is one shared by many. Clearly, uh, security's here. I think people are walking around feeling pretty safe. At Super Bowl Central in downtown Phoenix, the security presence is impossible to miss. Bag checks at the gate, surveillance up above. You see, we saw a lot of people walking with the security black shirts and khaki pants. More than 7,000 local, state, and federal law enforcement officers will be protecting the valley this weekend. And it's not just people. Helicopters and other equipment have been brought up from the border. In the nature of surveillance, screening equipment, uh, canines. In this case, equipment missing from the border is okay. That does not divert too much away from our border security mission. According to the secretary, the border and the big games events are safe and secure, leaving some people with another thing to worry about. Finally here and I don't have a ticket. Secretary Johnson says there are no credible terrorist threats against the Super Bowl and the threat level has been the same for the past 10 years.